Let's make a date with gravity. It's time for the best physics games you should play in 2021. Despite what you might have experienced at school, it turns out physics are fun, especially in games. Whether that's realistic physics just made more challenging with specific controls or a slightly weaker center of gravity, physics-based games are often hilarious and frustrating in equal measure. But that's what makes them so satisfying. Lining up that perfect shot, making that glorious slow motion leap for victory, it's all the more glorious when you know that the world is actively working against you. So here's our pick of what to play in 2021. You probably know all about human full flat and gang beasts, but if you want to see them in action, check out our best ragdoll physics in games in the video on screen now. After this one, of course. Mind your... oh, never mind. Few things in the world are more satisfying than pulling off the ultimate heist, planning a route, carefully taking into account all variables and effortlessly succeeding. Well, tear down is what would happen if you handed Danny Ocean a sledgehammer and offered him a digger instead of a Las Vegas limo. This is a game about both stealing things and destroying everything in sight. Here, you'll arrive at a level, check out your goals and take the time to crash, smash and bash your fastest route to get everything you need and an all-important escape path. Once you grab your first stealable, it's all to play for, so you had better make sure you found a way out before it's too late. Plus, if you can't handle the stress of the campaign or the even trickier challenger modes, there's always the sandbox maps, so you can just spend time crashing personalized trucks. It's probably an existential question. What kind of physics games list doesn't feature Besiege? If there is one, we never want to watch it. Besiege is the oldest game in this video, but if the wanton destruction of castle ramparts is on your to-do list, it's probably time to build your own siege engines. Again. And again until you've laid waste to every single kingdom in the game, each one with their own very specific defenses that will require a unique design of engine. Besiege is enjoyably complex, and you'll spend plenty of time in your own head asking yourself very serious questions about cannons and angles. The toolset is vast and you're going to spend a long time crafting a seemingly perfect murder machine that's probably going to fail for the first 10 attempts, and that's okay. Back to the medieval drawing board for you. There are plenty of cooking games out there we know. We've played a lot of them, but very few actually take on the realities of the kitchen in the same way that Cooking Simulator does. The deft twist of a blender to make sure that every last tomato is shredded, the careful glugging of broth into a pan, or the shaking of just the right amount of pepper onto your baked trout. All of these things require a steady hand and an organized brain. How is it that something as simple as controlling a spatula can become the ultimate challenge? Oh, I mean, three second rule, four second rule, five second rule? Oh, just cook the other side, no one will notice. Now, with pizza DLC that just makes us really, really hungry, and an upcoming shelter add-on for specialty apocalypse chef antics, Cooking Simulator is the ultimate test of your kitchen skills. From one ridiculous sim to another, the fact that Totally Accurate Battle Simulator has to try and convince you of its grounding in reality in the title doesn't exactly bode well, does it? In fact, we don't think we've ever seen anything less accurate, but that doesn't mean that this ludicrous affair isn't constantly entertaining as you work out which factions can send the others spinning into oblivion. Tabs is now finally out of early access and describes itself as having the wobbliest physics system ever created. And we absolutely agree. This is a world where it feels just as hard to carry a sword as it does to fire a siege machine, and that means every second is packed with some of the most absurd action we've ever seen. Get your googly eyes on this, you won't regret it. This mammoth might, though. Ah, full guys, how we love you. It feels like only a matter of days since we all almost literally fell down a rabbit hole filled with jelly beans with legs, but Full Guys Ultimate Knockout is now in its fourth season. What hasn't changed though is our eternal wobbly battles with not just gravity, but also the other players messing up our perfectly planned seesaw-based victories. And if you thought Full Guys was colorful before, season four is packed with neons to sear into your brain while you avoid lasers in even more 
chaotic levels. Ultimate Knockout remains truly addictive because you can never blame the game for your failings. The rules are clear. Okay, that was your fault. Ah, uh, that was her fault. Okay, definitely his fault. And, oh dear, eyes on the crown, people, eyes on the crown. The problem with that one more go mindset with sticky flawed arcade machines is that you're playing with your own money and, let's face it, you're here to lose. Which is why the coin game, which is currently in early access from just one developer, is so satisfying. While there's a survival mode where you can earn money and go to the scuzzy pawn shop, you can always load up birthday mode and play as many physics-based coin games, ride in as many limos, and take as many trips to different arcades as you like. Whichever game you're playing, you'll earn tickets that can be taken to a dedicated prize station for all kinds of exciting plushies. And when you get tired of desperately playing stacking games, you can always just fast travel to your house, put your feet up, and settle down with your pet, Goose. Hmm. No, don't go! Please come back! Our final entry might look like a golf game, but What the Golf takes the vague idea of hitting a ball into a hole and runs with it until the birdie-filled experience is basically a distant memory. Instead, every single level of this glorious sprawling campaign reinvents the way to get to a hole with a flag in it. Whether you're steering a squishy, sticky blob, pinging about a ball on legs like a Mario level, or having more fun with the golfer themselves, this is a relentlessly inventive physics-based experience. Even exploring the menus is more fun than most games, and What the Golf also has that unnerving ability to make you smile with joy while you play. Quite frankly, it's all too imaginative and wholesome for words. Yes, wholesome. We went there. At least we're at the end of the list, yeah? So those are some of the best physics games you should play right now. Let us know your favourite battles with Newton's laws in the comments below. Drop us a like if you enjoyed the video, although not on our heads, please. And subscribe to Logitech G for more videos just like this one. Oh, and if you do already subscribe, hit that notification bell to know exactly when our next video arrives.